Alright guys, what's up? It's Shockwave here, and we are playing Skyblock Survival. Um, this map is with, I think, the number one survival map that's been played. Uh, I don't remember the exact uh, amount of times it's been played, but I remember it's uh, one of the top survival maps of Minecraft. And um, due to having to do this a third time, I installed too many items. I will not be using it unless it is necessary to get something, you know, like uh, a sampling... Um, which I've had to do. So, like, if I had, one, if I needed one of these, you know, then I would get a snack, uh, just a thing of this, and then I would, you know, uh, use it to make another tree. Simply because three times now I've had to restart because I get no saplings out of here, and I am essentially screwed. So, um, I will not be uh, cheating in that regard to just spawning, uh, you know, say, you know blocks of, you know, like Lapis Luisi or something like that, and wanting to, you know, just do something like, you know, placing it or something like that. Like, I will not be doing that, so uh, I will just be playing it legitly. Um, so let's go ahead and get rid of this, and let's go ahead and get started with the, um, the world. So I need to make, um, actually, I'm going to need to make a cobblestone generator first. And I do this first simply because I like um, making my cobblestone first. So let's go ahead and make this. And that was bad. Okay, that was some slight lag I had there. Um, let's go ahead and pick this up and regenerate the water. Sweet. Now I have a water bucket. Put the dirt in here. Um, let's get some wood for our tree. Or from our tree, if uh, I decide to speak any modern language. So let's go ahead and get four of these. There we go. Four of those. Generate that. Turn those into a crafting table. And then we'll turn some, get some sticks. And then we'll make a wooden pick. I'm only doing this on rapid fire because I've done this about three times before already, so I know exactly what to do. Let's go ahead and just get some cobblestone. Oh, wait a minute. Um, I have one more provision to my cobblestone generator that I make. And there you go. And let's start generating more cobblestone. See, so yeah, as you can see there, that would have gone in the lava if I didn't have the dirt on top. This The dirt prevents it from going into the lava in, uh, one, in the up direction. Or at least, or at least in the, uh, whatever direction it is. I have no idea what direction it is. So, um, let's go ahead and keep going. I think that actually is enough. I No, actually, I need more than that. I'm going to need a lot of cobblestone to make, um, a ring around our tree to catch all, all of our saplings. Because I need that to, um catch saplings that way, ow, I can uh, just keep generating cobble as this goes. So let's go ahead and the tree was here. Oh wait, I need to use the dirt. Actually, and the water froze up again. Stupid snow biome. Let's go ahead and get the dirt out. And let's go ahead and make a ring. So one, two, three, four, five. And then let's make another ring around that. we go and that should be wide enough to collect all the saplings so let's go ahead and kill the tree and then we should start getting saplings so hopefully this all goes according to plan I don't have to um, regenerate any saplings from too many items. I want to try to do this without any sort of mods, but if I have to, I mean I have to, but I have done this uh, legitimately and it was a lot of fun actually doing this. Um, let's go ahead and make ourselves a cobblestone pick before I forget. Let's just go ahead and keep generating. And actually, you know what? Just because this is going to be probably the most entertaining portion of the video here. Let's go ahead and speed this up. So, enjoy the uh, quick cobblestone generating montage. Hey, 
I got two saplings this time. Yay! Last time I did this, I only barely got one sapling. But now that I have two, I theoretically should be able to make a whole bunch of trees. And then I should be able to, hopefully, not lose anything again. And by lose anything, I mean by not having to uh, restart my world again. Because that is definitely a frustrating factor. So I wish that thing would stop burning my cobblestone. So I need about, I think it was 40 if I had counted correctly, cobblestone to start working on our bottom layer to catch all the dirt so I can spread it out. Um, stop burning my stuff, please. Okay, here's my wood pick. Now this should speed up a little bit. Wow, that is generating really fast. Yeah, this is generating really fast. This is like a factory. Good lord. I can barely even keep up. The particle effects are still, like, still there as I'm generating. Wow. This is fast. Okay. I, I appreciate, I, I, I do appreciate this now. Let's just keep going, because this is, this is just like clockwork. It's basically like as soon as I click and let go, I have to uh, re-click again. This is really nice. Oh, wow. I definitely have more than 40 pieces of cobble, just saying. Um, let's go ahead and... Actually, let's just go ahead and pick up all the pieces. Ooh, that's a lot of cobble. Oh, I got three saplings. Oh, yes, that's nice. Oh, that's so nice. That's so nice to have three pieces. Three saplings. Let's go ahead and put those away so I don't lose them. Same with the bucket. And actually, same with the stone pick, just in case I fall. Let's go ahead and start working on the bottom floor. This is going to be a little difficult. Okay. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yes. Okay. There we go. Now it's time to make a bottom floor. Thank goodness for the sneak button, otherwise it, this would be impossible to place without dying. Actually, let's go ahead and just line, make a line of the upper floor here. By line, I mean like, I kind of outline the upper floor of dirt. And then, oh wait, uh, this one is outlined, okay, so do here. And then I'll just do an outline around this, so that way... I can collect all the pieces safely without having to worry about my imminent falling. Let's go ahead and just expand this. 